Hello, this tutorial is designed to get you using Wimba Pronto in your courses at Grand Rapids Community College. Pronto is a program that will allow you to chat with your students or instant message. It also allows students to instant message with one another. So this tutorial is going to cover downloading Pronto, launching Pronto for the first time, changing some preferences, and then just showing you how to chat with Pronto. There are lots of advanced features which we're not going to cover in this video. So the first thing, you need to log into Blackboard. And over here on the left side, there is an instant messaging Pronto link. And you need to click on that and click on Get Pronto. Now, you can download this in both the Windows format and a Mac format. I've downloaded it and installed it. You'll go through those steps. And once you've done that, you'll need to launch the program. You put your username and password in. Um, I like it to remember my password. I don't want to sign in automatically, and I'm going to click this. Wimba has some telltale sounds along with it that you'll get used to. Um, the first thing is go click on Pronto, whether you're in a PC or a Mac, and go down to Preferences. And there are two general preferences that I think everyone needs to look at, and it's whether or not you want to start Pronto when your computer starts, and whether you want it to sign in automatically. So I don't want either of these. And then you can change your profile by clicking on Profile. And if you're on a PC, I think this, tab, this bar here runs up and down. So Profile's at the bottom. You can put your email address, a little bit about yourself. You can share some websites. And you can also choose a picture to have represent you when people chat with you. Click OK. Now all you have to do to chat with someone or instant message is double click on their name and it will be lit up if they're available. So right now no one is available but I'll show you how it works. You can type in whatever you want, how are you, and you hit enter and it will send that message to that um, individual. Now when you click on classmates it will show you your courses and the students that have actually loaded this. So you do have to remind your students to load this on their computers if you want them to use it. So that has been the tutorial for Wimba Pronto. I hope you enjoyed it.